The truth is that many of us are cuffed to things that have become, let me say it in a biblical term, idols. See, an idol is not just a statue that people worship. An idol is anything that has taken the place of God. So for some of you, you have idols that you birthed. Some of you have idols that you live in. Some of you have idols that you drive. Some of you have idols that are celebrities. Some of you, it's taken the place of God. When they say do it, you obey. When they say lift your hands to give an offering, pay a hundred and something dollars for the ticket. What do y'all think they do at concerts? And every time you go in there, everybody put your book of, book of hands up. What, what is this the sign of? Surrender. Y'all, y'all don't. At every game when they score a goal, grown men with their shirts off, painted blue on one side, red on the other. He's a lawyer during the week, but a fanatic on the weekend. Doing what? Giving. Serving, making time for, in community with. It has become an idol. And what God is saying in this series, he said, this is a deliverance series that I want you to cuff from everything that has been an idol in your life. Everything that has taken my place. And the truth is, most of us don't know we're cuffed to it. It's just what we think is normal. But it's killing our calling.